everyone. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to adjust that really quick. Um, anyway, so today I'm talking about Nana. Um, Nana's a story about these two girls with the same name, and they are completely different. Their characters, you know, one is sweet, just, you know, your regular type of girl, kind of dumb, and the other girl is high school dropout, she's hardcore, she's in a punk band, and through fate, they are brought together, and they become best friends, and they share, um, a lot of good memories and a lot of bad ones, too. It's a really good anime, if, girls, if you haven't watched it, um, definitely you should. I generally don't like anime like this, because it is very centered around love and friendship, but I found that, like, I actually enjoyed it. Partly because it's actual, like, it felt real. I mean, one of, uh, Nana, which they call her, um, Hachi, it's like a funny joke that they kind of made up because they're both Nana, which means seven, and Hachi is eight, so they call her Hachiko, or Hachi, and, um, she gets pregnant, and there's drama, and it was, it was pretty good. Okay, but my beef with it, I really don't like the ending. I mean, the last couple of episodes just went totally downhill, you know, fine, Hachi got pregnant, okay, but then she started going out with, um, that stupid guy from Trap Nest or whatever. And I didn't like that. And in the end, she actually stays with that guy. I mean, he didn't love her, and her whole life was just about wanting to be loved. Dumb. Um, but, first thing for me to do is study in an hour. Yeah, so, uh, kind of fail ending. Still worth a watch. Anyway. Okay, so another anime that I just finished watching is Hanaki. Uh, if you can't understand what I'm saying, check the description, it'll be there. Um, Hanagi is really cute. Moe, moe, moe! Um, there's this, like, god. Uh, actually, so she's a goddess, but whatever. Um, and she comes to Earth out of, like, this boy's, um, sculpture, like his art sculpture, and she lives with him, and of course, you know, he's living by himself for some weird reason, and it's just kind of a typical, not necessarily typical anime, but like, it's very cute, um, I don't know how to explain it really, oh, I'm so bad at this, <laughs> sorry! But anyways, like, I, it was enjoyable, um, definitely, if you're into moe, cute anime, um, you should check it out. And, um, uh, I don't know, hmm, well, let's see, yeah, so, I guess, I could talk about it more, or maybe not. Why am I listening to you? Seriously? I'm sorry, my music selection is crap. Aww. Okay, this next song is from Nana. The music, well, I really like the music. Um, the main artist that does the songs. She's actually, um, Ichigo from, um, Kamikaze Girl. If you haven't seen that movie, it's a beautiful movie. Um, <laughs> kind of like Nana, actually, now that I think about it. Like, there's this one girl, uh, Momoko, who's, like, in love with Lolita. Baby Starshine Bride is her god. And there's this Yankee. Yakuza type girl, Ichigo, which is the girl who sings the, um, this song, and um, yeah, they become best friends, 
So that I mean that's a cute movie. Anyways, okay, so Nana overall uh, maybe a a seven. <laughs> Nana gets a Nana on my scale from one to ten. Um, is it worth buying? I don't know. Maybe not. Tanagi? Yeah, same thing. I mean, it definitely had its high points, but... I don't know. I wouldn't buy it. It's not, you know, amazing, lucky star, haruhi, whatever. Um, definitely not super popular. So if you're looking for anime that's kind of, you know, doesn't have that much of a fan base, you can go ahead and watch that. Okay, so, thank you very much! Um, bye!